How's it going guys? I'm Garrett from Sutomo Lures here. Today I wanted to show you guys how to put skirts on, say um, if your lure head's a little bigger for the sh uh, skirt size. So today we're gonna be skirting a nine plus invert, which is bigger than a normal nine, but it's like a small 12, but we still wanna put nine inch skirts on it. So, and especially because this particular head is a uh, um, invert, so, if it's an invert or a cut face lure, then it's kind of hard to get the smaller skirt on. If it's a bullet because of the taper, you can still squeeze it on. So I'm gonna show you guys a couple tricks today on how we do a nine plus lure. So the bottom skirt, we're just gonna um, squeeze the skirt on from the back. Get it lined up to where you want it to be and I'm actually gonna I'm gonna flip it but I'm gonna trim this skirt um, after I flip it so um, today I'm using coconut oil just because I don't have any silicone spray I've been kind of using coconut oil lately instead of silicone spray I'm just gonna lube both sides and I'm gonna Simply squeeze the skirt on from the back side. Again, because because it's harder to skirt it the normal way, I'm gonna do it this way so I don't gotta struggle with this underskirt. Get to where I want. Same knot. If you guys want to see the knot that I use, um, you can go back to some of the other videos and it's a pretty simple overhand knot that I use. Okay, so even though this is only going to be a two skirt combo, um, Because of the taper, of, this head has a lot of back taper, so I want it to kind of back taper and hit the front skirt and not have this little bulge right here. So I'm going to actually trim the ring off, even though it's only a two skirt combo. For that, I just take a small scissors and I just trim. You can do this with a razor blade. Um, I know a lot of guys do it with a razor blade, but it's a lot more dangerous, so I just use the scissors, small scissors. Go right around. Okay, so now you got your bottom skirt on. Pretty easy, basic. Now what I have here is my top skirt and I already cut the um, head for it. And I got it in some warm water. Um, which softens the plastic and makes it stretch a lot easier so like I said if it was if it was gonna be a bullet then you know pretty easy to put it on but because of the face of this lure you're gonna have some difficulties so what I do is take your normal bullet and I just kind of pre-stretch the skirt and if you can find one of these, there's just a big chrome bullet. So same thing, you can use whatever you have, but the thought is just to kind of pre-stretch the skirt before you try and do your actual lure. And then Go heavy on the lubrication. What you don't want to have happen is for you to get the skirt like halfway on or three quarters of the way on and then it gets stuck and it won't go on or won't go off. It's 
complete pain in the butt. So go heavy on the lubrication. And now that you're actually gonna put it in the water for a little while. Now that your skirt is warmed up and it stretches easier, you might have a hard time seeing this because I hold it close to my shirt. But Let's see. Then you just kind of walk it over the edge and push it on. I tend to twist and push. This is where heavy lubrication helps as well when you're trying to line up where you need the top and the bottom line to be. Adjust the skirt. on your top knot. Finish it off. And then again, a little heavier on the lubrication under the skirt, just so when you flip it, it doesn't stick to itself. So makes it a lot easier to put your skirt on. When I'm impatient and I don't go, you know, I don't want to get up from skirting and go get a cup of hot water, then I, you can still do it. It's just a lot more struggle. And a lot of times um, what will happen, like I said, is you'll get the skirt halfway on or three quarters of the way on and then it'll get stuck. And then you waste time trying to get it off and then, you know, go through the process again. So. Um, warm water, a big bullet that you can pre-stretch the skirt out with and then if you have something um, that's really big just to help stretch the skirt out and then when you're ready to actually put the skirt on go with a lot, lot of lubrication and it should go on pretty easily once you go through that process. Um, the, again the main thing is like setting everything up when you know you're gonna have to tackle a bigger size head for the skirts that that you want to use so hope this video helped you guys um if it did please hit the like button and check us out at sutomulures.com and on instagram and facebook at sutomulures thanks guys best of luck out there